You know what I could go for about now? What's that? Uh, a huge ice cream cone. And I'm not really? talking about like a little ice cream cone. I'm talking about you give me the biggest ice cream cone you've ever seen in your life. Huge. Like uh, big as a house. As big as a, if you show me ice cream as big as a house, I will eat it. How about the twisty tree? Oh, that's too big. That's way too big. Uh, it came from Florida. The ice cream cone came from yes. Florida. How did you decide we're going to take this giant ice cream cone up to Clyde, Ohio? Well, my son's always doing some dumb thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back up that dump truck full of hot fudge. We got the helicopter. He's in charge of the cherry. We got the whipped cream tanker over there. Everybody OK? Let's go. What do people in Clyde think about the cone? Oh, wasn't. Some of them didn't like it at first. <laughs> but now, after 14, 15 years, it's got to grow on you, right? Yeah, it does. Yeah. It does. All right. Oh, does it ever. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's really interesting. You know what, though? I have one kind of small question, but it's right. it's interesting. I okay. mean, they brought right. the whole thing from Florida, and, yeah. and, you know, I understand. But how, how did the ice cream cone not melt? I mean, how did they keep it from melting? Hmm. It's That is a terrible question. Terrible. I, I kind of feel the same way. 